Hello and welcome everyone to our YouTube channel. So in today's video we're gonna be showing you how to fix a cracked oil pan on a 1987 BMW E30. So stay tuned. So as you can tell we've scraped the oil pan on the road somewhere which caused it to crack and start leaking. So we're gonna be taking it off and welding it. First we're gonna drain the oil out of the pan so it won't drain on the ground overnight. guys so now we're gonna be removing the drain plug and using the genius method which uh, contains all the oil by cutting a bottle and draining it into a bigger bottle which makes the spillage as minimum as possible So it's the next morning here, we're gonna start by disconnecting up a couple of stuff before lifting the engine up, like the air box, the radiator hose, a couple of fires here and there, and all the stuff that's dangling between the engine and the chassis. So after removing the engine mounts, we're gonna start lifting the engine up using this emergency winch, which is used on off-road trips, which is 15 bucks and it's way cheaper than buying an engine hoist just to lift the engine up to remove the oil pan. So it's a good tip if you have a sturdy post to use as an anchor. And if you haven't noticed, we're doing everything on the ground, so we couldn't film from the underside. So we took the bolts out of the oil pan off camera. Now you can see us pulling the oil pan out. Now, finally, the oil pan is coming out. Now we're gonna cover the exposed engine internals with a nylon bag. So now all we're gonna do is lower the engine down on its mounts without the knots. Now would you look at that engineering! Look at that genius! Now here you are cleaning the oil pan from the gasket stuff and from the inside preparing it for the machine shop. And here it is at the machine shop getting welded. Brand new! So here we are back with the car ready for installation. Or at least ready for prepping for installation. Because we're gonna start the sealing process. Which if you own a BMW you know that it's an oil leaking machine. So we're gonna be using the only method to stop the oil leaks, which is using a lot of RTV. So don't hate us on the comments, please. Comment down below whatever you think, but be uh, kind. So as before, lifting the engine with this winch, which you're gonna see a lot on the channel. In, in upcoming videos, we're gonna be using it to pull a frame out. So stay tuned for that. Anyway, we're gonna be lifting the engine up again, slapping the oil pan from the underside, and well, watch and learn. Now, welcome to my new bed for the next half an hour. Well, I be installing. 50,000 volts around the parameter of the oil pan. Now that we're done from the underside, we drop the engine back on its mounts, 
started the nuts and started the assembly of the accessories that we have removed. Now all we need to do is to add some oil and it's ready again for duty. Thanks a lot for watching, hope this video was helpful, see you next time.